<laughs> all right, you've all got it now, probably. Who knows? No. Um, hey, we have one more act for you. Your headline act. This guy's absolutely fantastic. You guys, you guys have got one more in, don't you? Come on, I want to hear you. Yeah. This guy is one of my absolute favourites in the country. A headliner all over the country. That's the way. Keep clapping. Let's go. Raise the roof for John Cruikshank. Hey, what the fuck is this all about? Um, that, I don't even need it, but thanks for everything. Um, <laughs> that's what I meant to say. How's it going, everyone? I don't know. I, I don't know. My name's John. I don't know if you've seen me around before or whatever, but um, I've been on TV and CC TV. <laughs> so I'm out there, you know what I mean? Uh, doing a bit of work. Um, got a bit on, you know? Um, <laughs> all right, everyone, okay. What about this? Does anyone here, does anyone here drink coffee? Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's yeah. fucking everywhere. <laughs> It's everywhere near coffee, right? And like, listen to this, right? So today, I'm getting this coffee from this place, new place, I've never been there before, I don't know how I even really got there, but, you know, it's just life, you know what I mean? Just, I'm, I'm living my life, and now I'm in this place I've never been, getting this coffee, right? And like, it's a takeaway situation. I'm not having it there. You know what I mean? I'm taking it on, and... You know what I mean? But the person working there, this is what they say to me, right? They hear this, they go, oh, they go, oh, would you like a loyalty card? And I was like, what, what are you talking about? You know? And they go, oh, it's a loyalty card, right? They go, if you get 10 coffees here, we'll give you one for free. But I was like, what the fuck do you know about loyalty? <laughs> Right. How about you give me a free coffee and I'll come back and get ten cunt. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what it should be. Um, oh yeah, okay. What about this then? I, um... Well, wait till you hear it, you know, like... I'm not as good as you think I am. Um, what was I even going to say? Oh, yeah. So this, right? This, this, this one, this is about water. Right? The next joke. So this is what it is, right? So here, this is it. So this is it, right? Um, all water is sparkling, right? If you turn the tap on hard enough. <laughs> You know what I mean? Save a bit of money when you're out for dinner. <laughs> right? Still or sparkling, uh, still please, but fucking give it some. <laughs> you know, no worries. Um, oh yeah, I don't know. I got. I don't know if you can see up here. I got. I got some tattoos. Like that's just how it is. Like. That's life, I don't know if anyone else has, but like, I, I, I'm just going for sort of light coverage, you know, like, Vodafone. Um, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Don't want the full coverage, don't want to be Telstra, but like, this is why I got into getting tattooed, this is what I like about it, uh, this is what it is, right? Because it it's, just, it's just some proof that you had some money at some point. <laughs> You know what I mean? I made at least three grand in my life. Like, <laughs> what the fuck have you lot done? You know, like, a bit worse for yourselves. Um, I know, um, I know my voice, everyone. I know my voice sounds like quite thickly Australian, but um, the truth is, the, no. Well, the truth is, right? I was actually born in France. Yeah, I come from. A, I come from a town called Toulouse. <laughs> yeah, no worries, right? Uh, right? If you don't get that, I can't help you. Like, watch a fucking movie or something, you know? Like, I came to work, you know what I mean? Like, 
I showed up. Um, I showed up. Oh, what about this? I don't know. Hey, I don't know if anyone like rides their bike around or whatever, like push bike. But I'm riding my push bike around a bit to get around. It's, it's not bad, you know. But like, what happens is you lock your bike out the front somewhere, and what it is, it's it's a contract with the whole society not to let your tyres down. <laughs> You know, kind of thing, and like I was fine in that system for a long time, but recently, listen to this, right? I go back to my bike, and someone had let all the air out of both tyres, right? Yeah, and I don't know if it was a targeted attack or not. You know what I mean? And worse than that, I don't even know which one of those worlds I would prefer to live in. You know what I mean? What's worse? Like, they're both fucking hard, like. There's a cruelty in each, you know, and like, so it's a lot to deal with mentally. <laughs> the situation and physically. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? The hardest thing about it, this is what's happening, like, you know, emotionally, is I'm just there. Like, this is what's difficult about that situation particularly. Like, because, well, no, this is what it is. Like, you know, like, the air is fucking everywhere. <laughs> You know what I mean? There's no shortage of air, seemingly. Like, it's all around. I can breathe it in. I can, like, it's all here, but it's on the wrong fucking side. You know what I mean? Like, oh, yeah, okay. What about this? This is what I was thinking about, but like, because you know how you can get steak, like you get you get normal like beef burger and chicken burger, but then it's like steak sandwich, like, you know, the steaks on the bread, like, it's a steak sandwich, and it's only really because they both start with S. S steak and sandwich. If it wasn't for them starting with the same letter, it would just be a burger. I mean, it's hard to get your head around because you're indoctrinated into the alphabet system. But if the letters weren't the same, things would be different. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? No, it's true, because I went to Japan, whole different alphabet, you can't get it. <laughs> you can't get a steak sandwich over there, so... <laughs> you know, what's going on? Oh, man, I, um, all right, what about this then? Um, <laughs> Does anyone here speak? It's like a bit of food stuff, I suppose, but like, it just, well, it just gets, gets, gets in your head, but like, has anyone here ever had Thai food before? <laughs> yeah, I get it, right? But like, this is the thing, you know how you get, okay, so you get the Thai food, this is what's happening, right? You choose the sauce, you choose the flavour, you know, whatever that is, and you can mix that in with anything. That's cool with them, you know, like, you choose the sauce, you choose the flavours, and you can have it with the beef, have it with the chicken, have it with the pork, right? Have it with the prawns, $3 extra. You know, have the tofu, it's all right, mix and match. No worries, you know? But then you got like Indian food, right? And it's like lamb, rogan, josh, butter, chicken, right? Like the meat is particular to the sauce. You know what I mean? What's going on there? Like... <laughs> you, you know, like, something to think about, you know? Like... It's all crazy. I'll tell you what else something to think about, actually, while I'm thinking about it. Like, whatever that means, but, like... Life's so crazy now, like, it's all, you know, it's all technology now, but everyone's got mobile phones and, like... You know, it's changed everything, the mobile phone sort of thing, and like, every business now, it's, the turnaround's very fast paced, you know? Doesn't matter what you do, like, it's all changed now, like, it's all, you know? Like, this is what I'm saying, I even saw, like, I saw this company the other day, right, and this is what it was called, it was called Express Blinds. <laughs> right, and I was just like, fuck, how quick do you need them? <laughs> Oh yeah, g'day mate, uh, the sun's coming up. 
All right, thanks very much, everyone. Have a, have a great night. Thanks. Oh, my God, John Cook can't let him hear it.